Hey there folks and welcome back for another shaving video and today we're going to use Tobacco Nuit, I guess that is. Not 100% sure how you say that, but this is actually a pretty cool concept because when you ordered this it came as a set. You got this one, then you got Tobacco Oud, and also um, in the package were two aftershaves um, and it was 25 bucks. These are, are two ounce size but really if you figure all that up with two aftershaves two soaps um, pretty cool deal from the shaving shop or excuse me actually it's called the club a sort of a sister slate of the shaving shop no shipping so it was uh, 25 bucks flat and I really today I'm going to use uh, this one I really love the scent of this it's a sweet uh, tobacco I believe if, I, if I'm not mistaken it was made by Maria Armin of through the fire, fine crap, through the fire, you, you know, you know how that goes. Through the fire, fine crap. Anyway, um, she's a really outstanding artisan, uh, in my view, and this was a nice little set from the shaving shop. Again, um, the membership is like $3.95, I want to say, for the lower one, but everything is free shipping, and you get exclusives like this. This is a club. Uh, exclusive and Peter's really been banging stuff out um, in terms of exclusive stuff for the club and really has been doing a fine job so uh, I really have been I have really been enjoying the stuff that uh, Peter has been uh, doing recently and of course out of the club you can buy a bunch of other brands like Katie's Bubbles, K-Shave Works you know, and you, you go check it out if you're interested. Again, the, the URL is there if it sounds like something you are interested in. Okay, looks like we've got a nice load on our plus on. Let's wet the face, get going, stay tuned. All right, so let's see how we do today with our club exclusive by Maria Arma. Again, let's get a little more water here. Really great artisan. Nice lady, and uh, she makes a really good soap, in my opinion. So, all right, all right, looks like we've gotten our lather just about down. Add a little bit more water to that. There we go. Love the scent on this. Scent strength, um, quite good. I'd call it about a Let's say seven and a half ish. Seven, seven and a half. Very nice. And today we're going to use another master welcome aftershave. And we'll talk a little bit about that at the end, but they are very inexpensive. I found out the price and for these uh, 15 ounce bottles, which is the standard size, they usually, usually sell for around $11 and something. That is very, very inexpensive for aftershave. All right, today we are gonna use the Delta Echo Slim and we're set on eight. And we'll see how we do with our club. Oh, that feels great. Really, really nice. Feels nice and slick. Good cushion, all the rest. Exactly what I was expecting from a Maria Armin soap. I forgot to mention her, or no, I did mention her. I forgot to mention some other brands the other day when I did my favorites video. And again, that's a that's sort of the what can happen when you have a ton of soap. Sometimes things get left out, and I forgot to mention. Uh, um, shoot, I'm, <laughs> I'm forgetting them again. Excellent. Shannon Soaps. And actually more than Shannon Soaps like Reef Point. Um, but anyhow, you can only have 10 absolute favorites. And, you know, it makes it tough because you love so many soaps. So that's why sometimes I do top list with more than 10 because there are way more than 10 artisans that you can buy from but I did cut it down to 10 there the other day but I had some honorable mentions and I certainly should have mentioned Shannon soap so I just wanted to put that out again all right first pass was absolutely superb we'll come back for pass two stay tuned all right and here we go for pass two this scent I really like 
nice sweet tobacco scent. It smells really, really nice. And I like it a lot. Beautiful. Oh, and by the way, I, I uh, got some soaps in that I ordered. Um, and usually, you guys know because you watch the channel, uh, most of the soaps I pick I like because, you know, I'm, I'm trying to buy soaps that, that I will enjoy because, uh, you know, I'm buying them to use, not just to show on video. I want things that I like, it, but lo and behold, out of like five or six soaps that I got in, I had like three misses, three soaps that I opened the uh, tops on and I did not like a sit. And that, it's very unusual for me to miss with, you know, on that many soaps out of a, out of an order, but I did, and I will do a video where I uh, talk about those, and uh, they just aren't for me on a scent basis, and uh, I'm not going to bother using them. I will give them away or, or something down the road, so anyway, I'll show that to you guys. Coming up, sometimes you read a scent description and you think you're going to like it based on the scent description, and you don't. It comes like, that's not what I expected, and uh, this happened with like three out of six soaps, <laughs> and uh, I usually don't miss that badly, because I'm usually pretty good about picking winners for myself, and uh, boy, I swung the bat, and I didn't even get close on these. I just don't care for them at all. I'll use something and show it on video, um, you know, if it's, if it's in, even remotely appealing to me, like, okay, maybe I don't love it, but I like it, I'll go ahead and use it and say, you know, it's okay, but these, I, I don't need, I don't like at all, so, there's no point in using a soap that you absolutely don't like in terms of scent, there's just too many great options out there, anyway, um, Pass two was excellent. Let's come back for pass three. Stay tuned. All right, here we go. Third and final pass. And I got to say, this is one of the nicer tobacco scents. Green tobacco, I guess it is. It's a sweet tobacco. It's one of the nicer ones that I've ever used. Um, I really like it. It's not too, say, floral. It's kind of like a nice cologne. Um, really like it. Great scent, and uh, for me, I think that the price is a great deal. You know, 25 bucks, and you get the two soaps and two aftershaves. This is 50 milliliters. Huh? Not bad at all, and you get a, you know, <clears throat> I think a good deal. No shipping, once again, coming out of the shop. And keep in mind that um, the post office raised their shipping rates again, so that Free shipping is even more appealing. They raise it like something close to a dollar. Two years ago, I could uh, send stuff out flat rate, and it was five eighty for a small. Now it's like um, almost eight dollars seven something. I think, if I'm not mistaken, I was reading that somewhere. And that's the thing about the giveaways. I pay for that stuff with my own money, so. It costs me more, but, you know, you guys, uh, you guys come and watch these videos. So when I get an opportunity to give things away, things were uh, sent, and sometimes stuff that I buy, I'm going to do it. What I should have said is I pay for the shipping still on stuff that, you know, sent to me and I give to you guys. And a lot of times I buy stuff um, with my own money and give it away as well. So, um... But, I have to say, the viewers of this channel are incredibly loyal, and uh, you deserve it. You deserve a giveaway now and then, so there will be more coming up, including a whole box of Master Aftershaves. Um, I think I have a couple more to show you guys, and then I will do the giveaway announcement on that, or I'll probably just announce it this weekend and give it away uh, next week, so stay tuned for that. You guys definitely deserve it. Um, I don't think I speak much about 
what an honor it is for you guys to come day in, day out and watch these videos. Because I put out a lot of content when I'm doing videos. When I'm not on sabbatical period where I just sort of uh, spend more time outside and so on. And I'm making daily videos. You guys are incredibly loyal. And so I want to thank you because it, it means a lot to me that you spend this time. You can't get back day in, day out watching these videos and listening to me rant and rave and carry on. Thank you. I mean that truly. All right. Let's uh, rinse the face. We'll come back and do the post. Stay tuned. All right. And we're back and we're bringing in the magic fairs. Which Hazel love this stuff. It's uh, part of my daily routine, as you know. Each and every shave, beautiful stuff. Not always inexpensive, but uh, it lasts a long time, even with daily use. You see it used here day in day out. Excellent stuff. This bottle, I've almost KO'd. I prefer out of the ones I've tried the uh, cucumber. Um, I just really enjoy it. It's my favorite, although the peach is good, too, if you like peach scent. Okay, let's review the equipment, and then we'll get to our master aftershave. This is the... Well, I'm holding up <laughs> the wrong soap. Let me find the right soap. Tobacco Nuit. I don't know how you say that. I'm guessing it's something like that. Uh, it was very, very nice. And again, there's also a matching aftershave that I will not use today because I'm going to use the master aftershave. We use the Delta Echo Slim, fantastic Astra Blade in here. I almost forgot to mention the blade. And the Poisson from France. This guy cost $80 back in the day before you could buy inexpensive Poisson nuts. If I had to pay $80 today for this, would I? Absolutely not. There are too many knots that are actually better than this for $10, $12. Bucks. Um, but... I will keep it because I did pay it at one time. That's just what they cost. All right, enough rambling. Today we're going to use uh, Master, um, and I believe again it's called Master Wellcome um, Bay Rum. And these guys, this is a 15 ounce bottle. This is 11 bucks, people. I mean, it's very inexpensive for that much aftershave. This is a large bottle. Look at my head. <laughs> so, um, for money, uh, for those of you on a budget, if you can find these, they do sell them on Amazon and various places. Not a bad price. Uh, they hang around, I'd say about, if you don't put a cologne on, three, maybe four hours. Um, but I got to tell you, for the money and the way my face feels, at least after using, quite good. They are a throwback in style. And uh, let's go ahead and put some on. We'll talk a little bit more about it. Um, they do have restrictors on them, so you won't, you won't pour out. A half a bottle um, with some inexpensive aftershave. Sometimes they don't come with restrictors or the restrictor is such that it allows you to pour out a ton at one time. Not the case with these. It is a proper uh, restrictor. This is Bay Rum and what I would say about this one is for those of you who are put off by Bay Rum that has a lot of clove in it and is very very punchy this one is not. This one is like sort of a mild bay rum without a ton of clove to my nose. Now, I will say right now, I have a sinus thing going on, so I can't smell as, as uh, perhaps as well as I normally do, but I can still smell it, and it doesn't, this is not heavy of clove to my sniffer. So, again, 11.55, um, that's quite a good deal for 15 ounces. And again, I'll be giving these away. I'll be announcing it probably on, probably Sunday this week so stay tuned for that face feels really nice thank you folks as always for uh, watching i really do appreciate it until next time let's make america shave again